It's about the research paper, the relationship of digit ratio with fast love at site and marriage stability. 49th work submit on neurology, psychiatry and mental health by SCI Tech Central Conferences. Here it is presented by Tomujit Mondal, India. Digit ratio is the ratio of second finger to the fourth finger on a hand which is measured of prenatal testosterone hormone. Small, two digit, small digit ratio indicates higher exposure of testosterone in uterus. Men having lower digit ratio are more sexual, whereas women with higher digit ratio are more affectionate and care for love. Here, we have taken 602 numbers of digit ratios of men and women as a reference and as a normal distribution, the probability curve area is calculated and the curve area implies the marriage stability probability. Here, this marriage stability should not be less than 0.5, it should be more than 0.5 for a healthy marriage relationship. The two digit ratios holding the same area from the mean is more reluctant to fall at first sight love. That is the introduction and second uh, th th introduction. The hypothesis is tested by a statistical testing. In 99% case, the hypothesis is accepted and 0.01% case, the hypothesis is going to be rejected. In 99.99% case, the women are reluctant to choose the first lover from the choice of our affection site, whereas 0.01% case, the women are more affectionate to her second lover or husband from the lover provider duality point of view. On this hypersexual aspect are studied here, not the economical aspect. This was the introduction. Now we are coming to hypothesis and objective. The hypothesis of the study was to count the marriage stability of human being that could be lead to a healthy marriage and could be saved from human being from divorce. To lessen the rate of divorce, to analyze the proper cause of first love at sight. Now materials and methods. Normally a plastic scale is used to perform the research work and measurement of digit ratios. As a sample, 2D and 4D ratio of C0 to men and women are used as a proper sample. With the help of these values, the normally distributed graph is calculated. The graph area is calculated to find the relationship stability number and the digits finding the curve are most reluctant to fall fast love with each other. Here are the results. We have taken these results, these number of digit ratios for men and women and they are mean and standard deviation, mean and standard deviation as a reference. Here are 602 numbers, their mean for the men is 0 0.9703 and standard deviation is 0 0.0324 whereas for women, the mean is 0 0.9722 and 0 0.0324. This sort of values we have taken. And this is the graph of left hand digit ratio. Here is the number for 602, the graph is maximum. And here for this 26 number, the graph is minimum. Now, with this sort of graph, we have calculated a sample to study. This is the frequency versus digit ratio for left hand and this is the frequency versus digit ratio of right hand. Now, the mean is taken as 0 0.9703 and standard deviation is taken as 0 0.0324 for 602 numbers of men and women and the curve is regarded as a normal distribution curve. Now the probability under the curve is probability in between 0 0.9703 and 
1.0027 that is 68.26 percent probability between 0 0.9055 to 1.0351 is 95.44 percent and the probability of 0.8731 to 1.0675 this is 99.673 percent that is 99.73 percent that we have calculated error functions we have at first we have integrated and then error functions we have calculated whose value is uh, exactly same to these values yeah we have taken for a man x1 digit ratio and for a woman x2 digit ratio which is chosen arbitrarily x1 lies left side of the mean and x2 lies right side of the mean then p be the probability of marriage stability z1 if we distribute it as a standard normal distribution then z1 is x1 minus mu by sigma and z2 is equal to x2 minus mu by sigma and if we calculate the probability it will become p1 equals to 1 by root under 2 pi into e to the power of minus 0.5 into z1 square and p2 that is root under 2 pi into e to the power of minus 0.5 into z square z2 square and if we subtract p1 minus p2 that is exactly equal to the value of marriage stability and if we calculate the probability of being single it will become 1 minus p by 2 for the value of x1 and x2 then if x1 be the first love at sight which is most reluctant to fall if x1 lies left side of the mean and x2 lies right side of the mean then the probabilities are p1 and p2 respectively then p1 equals to 1 by root under 2 pi into sigma into e to the power of minus 0.5 into x1 minus sigma by mu whole square minus 1 by root of 2 pi into sigma and p2 e2 will be the minus 1 by 2 pi root over of into sigma into minus of 0.5 into x2 minus mu by sigma whole square plus 1 by root over 2 pi into sigma if we equate this p1 and p2 if x1 value is known then we will calculate the value of x2 and if we know the value of x2 then we will get the value of x1 now if we statistic perform a statistical test that is 80 equals to mu equals to mu a and h a where mu a mu is not equals to mu a then for alpha definitely we will get the value alpha equals to 1 minus c then the standard formula of z c is equals to x average minus mean by standard deviation by num n number to the power 0.5 then this p value is coming the formula of the p-value is 1 minus limit by 2. Then from z table we are calculating the value of AR P and the p-value. If p-value is less than alpha, then the hypothesis is rejected. If the p-value is greater than alpha, then the hypothesis is accepted. Regarding this case, we have taken a standard value. x average equals to 0.97 and mu equals to 0 0.075 and sigma equals to 0 0.0324 and n equals to 602 for this case zc is coming minus 3.7863 uh, from the z table we are getting the p value equals to 0 0.00008 so from this table c is coming nearly about 99 percent and alpha is coming 0 0.01 then for this case 0.01 percent case the hypothesis is going to be rejected and 
the hypothesis is going to be accepted for 99.99% case and the marriage stability number is P. P should be in between 0 to 1. Now, conclusion, if we see from the point of view that is the smaller area of the card for men is smaller than the card uh, area for women from the mean. And it means those men who are having lower digit ratio is more stable in marriage stability with higher digit ratio female. They are also called, they are also mostly having a tendency to first sided love. If marriage stability is in between 0.5 to 1, then, the health, then a healthy marriage should not be below 0.5. And the remarks the economical aspect is not studied here, only the psychosexual aspect and social aspect of marriage and first side love is studied here. It is further aspects should be studied. Next, here are the references. We have taken the value from the uh, Matteo MG and Geron, the digit ratio and altruism, the evidence from a large multi-ethnic sample. Thank you all.